There's an interesting perceptual trick to these cards here. The line on this reference card over here is the same length as one of the lines on this comparison card, but it's not the one you think, and most people get it wrong. I guess I already hinted that the answer is B, but what do you think? Do you think that the line A, B, or C is the same length as the reference line? And pause now if you want to comment the answer before I give away the trick. So that card was part of a psychology experiment from the 50s called the Ash Conformity Experiment. In the experiments, eight students sat in a line, and the first seven were paid actors that were told how to answer on the set of cards. The actors answered unanimously, one by one, and the real subject of the experiment was positioned last so that they would have to answer after all the actors. But the actors were told to provide the wrong answer on some of the cards. In the control group, where subjects were alone with no pressure to conform, they answered correctly about 99% of the time. But in the experimental group overall, 75% of participants gave at least one incorrect answer out of the 12 sets of cards. On the one hand, only 5% of subjects always went with the actors' incorrect answers. And on the other hand, only 25% of participants always gave the correct answers no matter what the actors said. And when one of the actors went against the rest of the group, the subjects were much less likely to conform. And the study's been replicated a bunch of different times in a bunch of different ways. It wasn't scientific by any means, but I was going for more for like an appeal to authority, so I'm sorry I lied to you.